We back. K-pop. On lock. Two. Us. Here for another. With the fantabulous 13 that are 17. Uh, it's another choreography video, which I believe was our last one. But if I'm guessing, I don't know because Koo grabbed this out. But I seem to remember a lot of people in the comments going like, oh, you like the choreography, do you? Yeah. You think this is as good as choreography gets? <laughs> we have some surprise for you, Fred. And you go over to Thanks Video, and you click in the video, you watch the choreography, it's going to blow your mind. So here we are. Am I yeah. right? You are correct. Okay. We got to see it. They were very good. They were doing that crisscross line at the slow mm -hmm. pace, and then they sped up the pace. Yeah. And then you what else? You asked about the box? Yes, the box, which... So uh, some people said that's a marker for them for the dance thing and it it's also they usually put uh someone said that's the album their own album that yeah. they're about to make well i don't know i mean is the album in the box yeah okay so it's sort of like inspirational in addition to helping you get your bearings of center whatever yeah the center mark it's like saying where's the eye line on the cam where's my eye line then someone will like put up a little stick sitting next to the camera and be like, look there, that's the person. Make sure you're looking straight. I've noticed I don't nearly often enough look at the camera. I'm not even sure which one of these cameras is the camera within it. No. It does. No. <laughs> no. It doesn't look. No way. Bingo. It we doesn't... got our. We got our eye marker. It doesn't look like they have a. Uh... A box here, though. What kind of box? No, they don't have a box. Maybe they have someone sitting dead center, staring them down <laughs> in the thing. Cause it look they it looks um it looks like they're not in like a practice studio like on the last one, but like they're practicing. It's almost for a like concert a concert, almost like a sound like check. Huh? Yeah, but it's dancing. It is. I guess they could use that. What would you use as your center marker? Would like a picture of yourself, a head in a box, some something just not too distracting, I guess. But you I'd, know it's there. Yeah. Well, you want something, I think, flashy enough that you that would it would stand out. I don't know. I guess the box works. They know better than us. But let's check it out. Seventeen choreography for the song. Thanks. We don't have. Uh, Subtitles for this, so we're strictly watching the dancing and getting down with the groove of the music. But it's choreography video, we're more in it for the choreography. So let's do it. 17. And we thank you for thanks.
Yamadi. Deserve a break after that. Dang. There's some cool moves in that. They're like they're like jumping in sequence and doing some cool leg moves and parts. And there's that like lift part. Yeah. Do they ever do like a dirty dancing where someone just holds someone up and s- spins them around? Patrick Swayze and whoever other person in dirty dancing is. There's some good they moves might. in there. That was cool. Did you? What do you think about it being in black and white? I, I think it helps you f- kind of focus on the on the choreography. I had the opposite effect for me. Really? It kind of, I don't know what it was, but it threw me off a little bit having it in black and white. I was, one, I was making certain people stand out more. See, what? Well, stood out a lot more. And his jacket, there were just certain things. Okay. Also, I was looking at the side screen uh, at the start of it. I want to see the those first few shots real quick. Yeah, go for it. All right. So. And what's that lady saying there? starting out here so this is seeming like it's being used for a promotion maybe for concerts or something like that because you're not just going starting like a lot of them do at the thing again it's in the stage for an arena they're doing shots from behind them and then what did that lady say those of you that can this might be part of the speak the language maybe this is part of the that really long guy that people were asking about asking for it could be, or it could be for, you know, like how a lot of times comedians will have like a little opening sketch that leads into them coming out on stage. It could be something like mm. that. So give us the context context of that. But yeah, for some reason, it's I kind found... of like behind the scenes a little bit, right? Like Yeah, that still goes. Then we get to there. But I again, I like this. I like the song again. Yeah, I did. As well as their, their dancing. And who is that? That's the. I think that's the. Um, the short guy. He's wearing a shirt of himself. I meant who's on the shirt. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell. Yeah. Is anyone? I have no way of zooming into that. Looks like. I want to say a woman, but I just don't know. Uh, is it a popular cultural figure? Is it Taylor Swift? Are they Definitely Swift not fans? Taylor Swift. You say that, but there are a lot of Swifty fans out there. 17 knows good music and good dancing. If well, that's Taylor Swift... Well, I can't argue with that. Guess. Yeah, but it was good. It's hard, too. Like I always felt like dance moves where you go to the ground seems really hard to me. Well, it's, yeah. It's like 
one, the harder, the bigger they are, the harder they fall. Once you're down, you have to go all the way back up to a standing position and do it quick and fluid. Uh, that stuff. They did that, uh, basically the wave, but with their entire bodies. That was cool. But agreed. That's why martial arts master learned to do that, like, jump up thing from the ground. Okay. They can't be like, eh, hold on a minute. I'm gonna... Let me get okay. up. Uh, all right, ready. It's either you either do that or you do like that on your hands, spin around with your feet like a stooge. <laughs> Except instead of staying on the ground, they sort of work their way up, extend, then. You guys know what I'm talking about. I never did uh, the martial arts. I take it back. I've done three martial arts for one class each. Judo, one, Aikido, one, and Thai boxing. One class each? One class. I never got the first one. He went like, now, there's going to be a lot of work in this. And I went, all right. Thanks, anyway. <laughs> the second one, I think the judo, they had us dragging someone across the floor. And I was like, this seems a lot like Thai class. And called it quits. The Aikido. Also, I had to roll on my shoulder. It's like a lot of the college classes that I was taking. I went for one day. Yeah. And they lay, they laid out how it was going to be. Exactly. And then I was like, oh, it was a weight off my shoulders because I was like, <laughs> oh, and I know I'm not coming back. <laughs> exactly. They give you the full run. They want to weed out the, the weak and, and lazy for the first day, which is pretty much for all those. Two of them were college classes. The judo and aikido, and then the Thai boxing. I went on myself because my brother and uh, a bunch of his friends were into it. So we we're like, well, "All right, we'll go check it out." And I was like, Oof, "Nope, not worth it." I'm never gonna do the splits. Never gonna kick someone in the head. Tried to kick someone in the head one time, and I accidentally kicked them in the face. She was not happy. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> Understood, but not happy about it. Anyway, yeah, they got, they got moves. Get up, up, down, jump. They were like jumping in sequence, it seemed to me. Oh, yeah. They're, which is They tough. are, they're amazing. Yeah. Well, you wouldn't even know that I was jumping. <laughs> I jump literally, I guess that's maybe two inches. Like probably chin to nose is how high I get off the, the ground when I jump. I guess if I pulled my legs up. It would be higher, but as a straight jump with your legs straight, it's not bad. It's not good. I would say I have a two, two and a half inch vertical. Is that where it's measured from? From your feet to the ground? Or is it measured from how high you can get your arm up? Because um, they're hitting that thingy, aren't they? Yes, yeah, so I things. think they measure, they measure how your standing reach. Right. And then they'll, from, oh, from then, there, they'll measure it. All right, then yes, my statement stands, two and a half inches. <laughs> uh, point, point being, and that would be like college days. Now I'm going to give myself a, a solid two. Point being, they did good, was a good freeze frame shot. How do we get to, and they did that slow... Well, they did yeah, a lot of them where the, like they're all frozen, and then they did the slow speed up thing again. It wasn't didn't have that same move of like the cross where they're where you see how well they move between each no, other. No, this was way different, but it was good. Is this right where they do the wave? Yeah. Cool. There yeah. was. Nice. Oh, what are you? I like that last one you hit. I know, they're all in each other's way. Anyway, great work. 17. Uh, huh, no, we still got some time. We're going to get through the next one, but that was solid. They do good dance. I guess the next step would be yeah. live dance performance well i mean like live concert dance sure full on pageantry have we watched them in concert yet no we've seen one music video of theirs 
Then we did their killing voice. Oh right, they and, skipped the line real quick. And then yeah, they, and then two dance choreographies, and it's it's we'll like back. maybe stellar. one more music video, and then that we'll see. I don't know who makes the list. I make suggestions, but ultimate authority goes to the Koo Bird. But then I just sit and go, ooh, oh I like that. Oh, not that so much, but that yes, that was impressive. And that's how we do things around here. And that's why we need you so desperately. Q can only do so much research. We look to you, the fans, to make suggestions, comments, likes. Let us know what you liked about it. The Let carrots. Let us know if you think we're scum. We love it all. The carrots. Little carrots to nibble on. No. Keep us coming back. No, it's, Follow that's the their trail. fandom name. It's like uh, carrot, like diamond carrots. Oh. <laughs> I thought you meant leaving car diamond carrots. Yeah. All right. I like that. That's good. Okay, carrots. <laughs> we will eat you. What? Why? Because you nibble, you get a little carrot to nibble on. It means like you check. I don't know. That's not the kind of I'll carrot. Have to think, I'll have to think of a better metaphor, okay? <laughs> the point is, <laughs> thank you, carrots. Come through. Keep uh, giving those good suggestions. This was solid. Let us know of... Uh, Another great music video to check out or a uh, good live performance that we should check out and see what these guys do when it's all factors of pageantry and performance put together on a live stage. And we'll check it out. How do you feel about the, the four-hour guide they have? A lot of people have been calling for that. Four hours is a lot of time, You'd have to especially with the way I bloviate. You'd have to chop it up. Yeah, it would have to be four. a, a four-part. And please. I think it is a four-part thing. All right. Well, play your cards, right? Let us know if there's support. Like, there's two things we're talking about here. One is, would I sit down to watch a four-hour video on 17? And I would guess that all you carrots would say, yes, we've watched it several times. It's another thing to say, will you sit down and watch four hours of a 17 video with Austin Koo, where Austin add, tacks on another hour of talking between it because he can't shut his fat, smelly face. So if you want to hear more, if you want to see what we think and what we learn from it, then absolutely tune in, put it in the suggestion, and we'll do it because we live to serve. And we will watch it. I just, I just don't know what the demand for it is for us to see it. Well, Rig you up with the shock collar or something. Exactly. <laughs> get the buzzer every time I get on a long line. You, mm. <laughs> All right, play it, play it. We'll get through it, though. Anyway, thank you for the suggestion of thanks. Many thanks to the carrots for suggesting this one. We will keep checking it out. Let us know in the comments what you thought and what you want to see next. We'll catch you on the next one. Coop, us, K-pop, on lock. We'll see you soon. Push. Thank <laughs> you.